Greetings, Huntsman Hunters. Welcome back to Ruby JPDE. Okay, guys, in this next part, we don't have to wait long for the next part of the route to engage. This takes place just after we first explore Peak. You know, when we first meet the boss in his flaming monster form. So, yeah. With that said, here we go. Alright, who should I call? Who are you gonna call? I'm still fuming at Winter's intervention. Thankfully, she's gone. Well, you can only hope. I don't really understand her thinking. I don't know much about their family situation, but I've had the impression that her relatives were kind of off-handed regarding Win Weiss's private life. They said Winter then. <laughs> I can understand why she's worried about Weiss being getting into something like this, but to actually go and threaten people over it? What's her damage? Oh, I know what the damage is. I would love to put that video up on my channel but unfortunately when i took down my old channel mo that one video was the one that didn't you know download so it's gone forever i'm afraid <sighs> anyway back to what's really important and there's the ice queen herself hey weiss you know what maybe i should just do something very quickly uh, where is it? No, that's not it. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Ah, here it is. Coco. We're going to be changing what she's wearing. Because I like to do that when the third route comes along. Let's see now. Hmm. You know what? Let's go for... Hmm. Yeah. Let's go for this one. I'm pretty sure this is Lu Luca from Fire Emblem. I've never played Awakenings. I've played the, the sequel one, you know, Birthrights and Conquests, which was an okay game. Not brilliant, but okay. Kenshi, good morning. Perfect, just who I wanted to see. Hey, Weiss, you got a couple of minutes? Um, sure. Do you need how we dust assignments? Not today. I just want to talk to you about us. I, of course. Oof. Why is it, that makes that, the door to the dorm room sound so much larger and a little bit intimidating. I, I guess it's supposed to in, you know, indicate she's slowly closing it behind her. So we can have a private conversation. But who knows. <laughs> go Ice. Go, go, go Ice. Are you serious right now? <laughs> Somewhere else. Yes. Yes. I hope it's at least good news. I'd say. Even if it entails pretty raw conversation I had with your sister. With Winter. Yeah, it's kind of awkward, to be honest. And that's how it went. I can't believe this. I I can't believe she would, even after... I think it's exactly because of the fight. Don't think too harsh, harshly of her. You can't be serious! Make no mistake, I really don't care what, for the way she put herself out. But I can understand why she, where she's coming from. Hmm. Ah, you're a saint. Or maybe I, I want you in a good mood for what comes next. Yes, about that. I'm not really sure what you're asking of me here. I'm just offering you a third option. Hmm. I understand that it may be a bit atypical method of, of resolving things, but... Well, yes it is. Very much so. Okay, I'm completely honest with you, Kenshi. I'm of two minds of this. And I expected no less. On one hand, I can't have a solid preconsumptions about the, st the structure of our, rela of our relationship due to a lack of experience, so I'd welcome a way to end this without a conflict. An endeavour that I'm not 100% confident I would come out of victorious, being outgunned and outnumbered. Yes, particularly since the fact that, well, Evelyn's sh about your height, but she's a lot more developed. I mean, for God's sake, I thought Nora was the sh was the short stack. <laughs> actually, that's actually quite funny. You can call Nora a short stack because she is stacked. She's pretty short. Plus pancakes. <laughs> On the other hand, I know next to nothing. Like of two fourths of the party involved, and they know no next to nothing of you. Well, Ellen knows a bit, mostly due to the fact she's a farnace and you're a schnee, and your father is, 
Well, this would be the most hated man in Ruby. And Penny probably knows a bit about you because of her father, but that's not enough. Indeed, so, before making any decisions, I believe further understanding of this, of all sides needs to be reached. Absolutely. She w she went she went about this as uh, as I thought she would. Glad she didn't just refute or throw herself into this. Yeah, I'm glad. <laughs> but before any of that, though, huh? Uh oh, it's not going out well. I can feel it. All right, let's see if there's next event taking place because, like I said, it's been a while. Um, hmm. I think it's that one there, but I think that's the. Ruby and Weiss. Oh, no, this is probably it. Meanwhile, on the Atlas Lab Ship. Because I don't think I ever saw this one. Maybe I saw it last time. Oh, yeah, this is it. I think so. Thanks for the report, Winter. My pleasure, General. But... Uh-oh, this is not good. A message would have sufficed. Considering the nature of the information and my first-hand experience, it'll be best to come in person. True. You really are one of the best. General. Finding a complete, legitimate and unquestionable way to work to reason to come check on your sister. I assure you that isn't my intention. Winter, we know you, you love Weiss. Just because you're a bit of an ice queen doesn't mean you have to completely freeze your heart over to any form of affection. I mean, for the love of God... I love making fun of Ice Queens and media, but good lord. After all, you could literally call, if any of you have ever seen High School DxD, you could literally call Gilfia an Ice Queen. Because, you know, if you actually seen the series, you'll know what I'm talking about. I just love making fun of, like, you know, girls who have ice-based powers. Ice-based powers, so they are literally Ice Queens. <laughs> Indeed, just a side effect. How's Weiss anyway? I, wasn't, I haven't seen her since she gracefully... Recently accepted my recommendation for Atlas Academy. Safe, safe, completely, safe, completely ignoring it. She's doing well, and I'm sure she meant no disrespect. I know. If I, if I had to guess, she left the academy was too close to home. Yes, which is why she went to Beacon, said to be the best f formation academy for hunters in, in Remnant, because that was the only ir irreproachable alternative. I feel. A certain affinity. Yeah, so I mean, I doubt, no offense, but I don't think she'd survive very long in, um, Vacuo. Because I've heard that place is, you know, survival of the fittest, and... Yeah, Weiss's track record, from what I've seen, is not good. I guess it doesn't really... I guess it doesn't extend to everything, though. I'm glad to ha about that. One of my biggest worries was that, without me around, Weiss would gravitate towards my father's expectations, as Whitey did. She has the right to her own. She has her right to be her own person. True, but can you honestly blame Whitey? She he does not have many, f you know, male role models. After all, if you brought any other male comrade person into the into this, I'm pretty sure he'd be a better person. I always felt bad for every member of the. The Schnee family, because in my opinion, it's kind of like Jerry from Rick and Morty. That guy is literally a parasite of that family. But I worry that in her quest for individuality, individuality, she may have. Oh yeah, I remember this. Now this guy's. This is a cover of Crazy Noise Bizarre Time for JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Um, the diamonds are unbreakable. I do love this. This is actually a song I use for my wake up tune. It's a banger. It's. It's to distinguish her, and I've got to put it on quiet mode. Eddie's general. <laughs> I do love that music. Hmm. Weiss, good. You sat on him. Really? Yeah, that is. A simple. <clears throat> a simple intermediary tactic. You always begin with exerting your dominance. Why are you trying to intimidate my boyfriend in the first place? He's not your boyfriend. You certainly gave it your best shot. Sally Kenji is an upstanding human being and even asked me to not be too harsh on you. I can't believe... That... That... Uh, use me! He did... I didn't use you. I'm just a better person. I know what you're trying to do, which is why I didn't want anything bad to happen to you. You two are sisters, for God's sake. Excuse me. 
He purposely lured me into direct conflict with him to score pity and generosity points. That li the little snake. Winter, are you listening to yourself right now? Mr. Dykeboss, he's obviously more cunning than I am intimately thought. I can no longer think of him as a simple pervert. So he's some kind of criminal mastermind. Why go through all this trouble just to... Just to... Just to get together with me. That makes... Because you're a snee, you boob. Oh. I'm not like that. You think that... All you've ever going to meet are people who want to, s to suck up to you, hoping for scraps. The more insidious ones, the, r the real enemies to look out for, are those who promise you what you want and say what you want to hear. Kenshi isn't like that, isn't he? He doesn't even know who I was until who I was when we first met. I'm sure he didn't. I, I gotta go. Thanks for worrying about me, Winter. But please. Leave this alone. She's not going to. We already know what happens, people. We already know. Hmm. Winter, what are you thinking? It's a bad idea. I can't. Oh, great. This is not going to turn out well. I can feel it. Hmm. I'm worried too, General. Alright. Now, I'm pretty sure, guys, the next event doesn't take place till the weekend, so I'll cut you back in when I'm at that event. See you in a bit. Okay, guys, and we're back. So let's take a look to see what we can do with winter. Let's see. Maybe I could one? Hmm. I think this might be it. Time to have our first diplomatic meeting with Weiss. Here we go. All right, everyone's got their roles. I'm in charge of preparing snacks. I record the transcripts of everything. I'm your witness, I guess. Important to have a neutral party on things like this. Anyway, time to get my own task on and get some drinks. Be back in a few. Yeah, this is not going to turn out well. I can feel it. And thank you. Should cover everyone's tastes pretty well. Honestly, it seems more like we're playing a, bu a brunch than a diplomatic intervention. Which I guess I should be thankful for. Oh! Oof. Sorry I could use more gentle methods, Dagobius. Chemicals could be... Could mess with your pain receptors. You couldn't have gone for a simple chop in the back of the head. You had to sucker punch me. <laughs> what? What the? Ow! My head. Is that water? Wake up, Dagobius. Oh, God. Not this. Anything but this. <coughs> what? Where? What are the lab ship's medical rooms? It's currently locked down and isolated due to a sudden, suddenly secluded maintenance. I would like to stay as much until we're done. We'll stay as much as until we're done. Winter, if we're going to do this, we're going to do this right. So, in other words, if I, let's see if I have it. Where is it? Where is it? Nope, don't have it. Damn, I, th I thought I had it. What? What the actual hell? Uh, my, I'm stuck. I'm tied to this chair. Well, you haven't lost your spirit. This is a joke. This has got to be a joke. Let me out right now. That's not an option unless you're ready to confess. Ah, a moment. What? Here we go. Now you may talk. You're recording this? You're recording your own crime? Are you a psychopath? Is there anything going to stop making any sense anytime soon? I'm, I've committed no crime. I'm pretty sure kidnapping is a crime. Because that's what you've done here. You knocked me out and kidnapped me, you crazy broad! Um, members of Atlas Army can engage in police work on, on Alistinian or allied territory if no other Alistinian official is available and they deem a prep to be endangering a citizen of Atlas. The lab ship is also connected territory to Atlas, so there's no crime to be recorded here. 
You... Urgh. She thought of everything, didn't she? Let's get your questioning underway. Confess and I'll let you go. Confess! Confess to what? What you really want with Weiss. Oh, for... Mm. I've heard about scissor complexes, but this is ridiculous. Joking won't help you. Then you should stop ch clowning. Urgh. Urgh. M my head. I almost threw up. You should know. I had to stay methods of interrogation that lead to blood or gore and gore. Which is why my expertise in, in other afflictions like the sense of vertigo you're feeling right now. Again then, why did you approach Weiss? Oh god. Well, a fashion sense just mesmerized me. Ugh! Ugh. She's doing this deliberately. <laughs> Disgusting. So you'd rather humiliate yourself like this and tell the truth? Ah. Ah. Well, you know me. Oh, wait. You don't. Why are you pursuing my sister? Because her ass looks great under that skirt. You filth. And you're torturing me, so... Screw you! <laughs> this is not going out well. He's... He's not answering his scroll. He's... He's literally only had to go to the store in the mall... In the mess hall. W what? What could have happened in broad daylight in the middle of the school? How? Alright, let's calm down. For what he went out until now, there's been no bullhead, so he's still in the school somewhere. Otherwise, excuse me, I let myself in. General Linewood! Why are you... You should all come with me to the lab ship. It's about Mr. Dicobius. Winter. Yep, saw this coming a mile away. Ugh, ugh. My, my throat burns. Water. I'm probably gonna have a drink after this anyway. <laughs> I, I can't throw up anymore. But I, but I couldn't ten minutes ago either. You're clearly dehydrated. Normally I let you rest, recharge your liquid so that the questioning could continue with the same efficiency. Unfortunately for you, I don't have that kind of time. So capor so temporal it is. Ugh. She she busted my lip. Ugh, the vomit it burns. You forced my hand, Dicobius. I did, didn't I? Well, this is an interesting image. All you need to do is tell the truth. The... truth? This could all have been over from the gecko, but instead you're trying to hold on to your secrets. Ugh. I'm going to ask you once again, Dicobius. Then, I fear I'm going to start using more brutal methods of questioning. This... is torture, dammit! Why... are you... aiming for my sister? Well, this is going to be interesting. I was essayed. <clears throat> a, a young girl with... She held me down on her bed against my will. She tried. My partner saved me. Why are you telling me this? You can tell that I'm telling the truth, huh? I'm telling you because she was crazy. Literally so. What? She was slowly losing her mind. So despite how disgusted I was by her, how repulsed I am by the very memory, at the very least, she could say I was crazy. You instead have a very l lucid mind. You're level-headed enough to organize a plan to kidnap me, absolve yourself of guilt, clear enough to torture me. I did. 
The girl who tried to, to assault me was crazy. What do you have for doing this to me? What's your damage? My... My damage? Hmm? I... My... What? Oh! Finally, I knew they'd come. Kenshi! Oh my god, no, 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 no! Hey girls, watch your step. What? What's she do to you? I... <laughs> Miss Winter, please try to move right now. Specialist or not, God help me if you try and move a finger right now, I'll freeze your whole hand off and snap it at the wrist! Give him some space, please. Miss Dykeby is simply dehydrated. The bruising has subsided. We'll be gone by tonight, thanks to his aura. Now, Winter. G General, I... Always, perfec always the perfectionist. If you are actually recording yourself, how do you be treating this official... As an official pa Atlas police work, questioning of a prep... A perp seen as a danger to a citizen of a Atlas... Weiss Schnee. But that's a small problem. An unlawful action Mr. Dygabeus may have committed in this instant could have only been committed on the grounds of Beacon Academy, and as such, an example from the Allied Treaties. <clears throat> the exclusive jurisdiction of the Disciplinary Committee of Beacon is the figure of Miss Glenda Goodwitch. A request to proceed from any of the law enforcement agencies must go through her. That's not the part of that. This all makes me believe your judgment. Your judgment was highly skewed and biased, General. I'm. As of now, you're on leave, and you shall remain as such until you've sorted all this out, starting with yourself. Hmm. Gen. Yes, General. You can let her go now, students. Get lost. I'm very, very disappointed in you, Miss Winter. I know. Weiss, I... Being a schnee is terrible. Mom is an alcoholic, trapped in her own life. Dad is dad, and why is a little monster who wants nothing more than to throw up... Grow up to be just like him. But I always said to myself, Hey, at least there's Winter, my big sister. The specialist. I was so proud. Mm. I never thought one day I'd be ashamed of being your sister. There she goes. Heartbroken. Poor kid. Oop, sorry guys, that was my phone. Ignore that. Winter sneeze. Da What's Winter Schnee's damage? Whew. Well, that'll be interesting. I think it's going to be a little bit more. Because, oh, no, there isn't. <laughs> well, guys, I'm going to end the video here. Like us all, like, comment, and subscribe. Jeff, and I'm out of here. See ya.